Assalamu alaikum guys, I hope you're fine and doing well. Welcome to the second tutorial about read and write uh, into text file. Okay, in the previous tutorial we did how can we write into a txt file. We uh, had a complete object, convert it into JSON and then write it down into a txt file. Okay, you can write down anything if you write some text here, some string, whatever. <clears throat> now we will see how can we uh, look, how can we write, um, read, sorry, from that file. Okay, so same, it's the path of that file. Then what I did through system.io.file library, I'm reading all the lines from that file okay and then i'm getting the first line line zero it's a it's string array right so so i'm uh, i am getting only the first line okay if you have multiple lines you can loop through this array or if you have only as i have only one line so i'm getting the first line right and then i'm converting back it into object these serialize object okay first we convert it into json now i am converting back back into the this object user registration model okay but here i have to pass this uh, um, this object this class so that it can be compatible okay and then what i did okay before if we clicked on edit here okay so running yes if i go back if you click on edit what it does it uh, take this data right and display in the those text fields now what i did i will take the the data from the file which i have saved inside okay and then i will convert it into object and then i will return that object into the view so we will see okay which which data okay this one we created this new record okay this record is uh, inserted into the database as well as it is uh, written into a text file so i will get from the text file not from the database okay so edit go so look data is here but i what i did i don't know okay we will go we will step over right if you see we got that data that json data from this file if you see as i told you it's in array so i will get the zero record see and i will convert it into what object it is converted into object and then i return that object into the view okay i did not get before i was getting it from the database okay from this table into the database where id is equal to id but now i was just for the sake of writing it and for the sake of this tutorial i in the previous tutorial i read into i write into the that text file but now in this tutorial i I am reading from that txt file and how I read okay this is the library okay read all lines okay how many lines are there and then you can if there is many lines you can loop through this uh, array but I have only one line so I just got the first record and then converted it into object and then I am returning that object into the view and you can see the data is displayed how the data is displayed i have done it in the previous tutorial okay if you go to the view so i have this strongly typed view with this model user registration model and then i have it everywhere okay so i hope you got it if you have any question you can ask me and the comment and in the next tutorial we will do how can uh, we will talk about uh, folder watcher right how can we get notified when someone inside this folder update 
a file txt file if someone delete a file if someone create a file so we will create a function here and we will get a notification we will get that function will be hit right and we will get to know okay thank you so much if you have any question you can ask me and please don't forget to subscribe my channel for more videos